Question 9. Which statement about enthalpy change is correct? A. Enthalpy change of reactions are always a negative. Good. This one is wrong. We know that reactions can be exo or endo. So it means it can be negative or positive. Okay, B. Enthalpy change of combustion is always positive. So we know that uh, when something is uh, burnt, uh, we can feel the heat because a uh, heat release from the system. So whenever a heat release from the system, so it's always exo, means it's negative. Okay, so therefore, B is wrong. C, enthalpy change of formation always positive. For formation, it uh, depends on the uh, elements and the products. Uh, not always uh, positive. So it can be positive or negative. Right, so this one also wrong. Enthalpy change of neutralization always negative. Yes. Uh, neutralization is always uh, release heat. Is, uh, we can feel the heat. Um, so therefore, okay, this one is exothermic. Okay, and it's always negative. So it's correct. Answer is D. Okay, number 10. What is the definition of standard enthalpy change of neutralization? Uh, then you have to uh, recall back what you learn in the, this uh, enthalpy change of neutralization uh, for the, I mean I mean the definition definition is the the key is to form one mole of H2O means when the acid and the alkaline reacts form one mole of H2O uh, that's the definition uh, <clears throat> for the details uh, of course uh, please refer to the textbook uh, for the the complete uh, definition so it means uh, it just can be D, right? Okay, when the aqueous acid and the alkaline reacts, if they're able to produce one mole of water, okay, the heat that release it can be the it can represent the standard enthalpy change of neutralization, right? Okay, that's all. Thank you.